Hey, this is Otto Ropesman, and you're in the place for athletic super achievement. Continuing with the winner's mindset, you know, part of the winner's mindset is really being 100% focused on being a playmaker. Not someone who reacts to plays, but someone who creates plays. Someone who makes plays happen. Now, that, that may be on the scoring end, and that may not even have anything to do with scoring. You know, in, uh, in, in one playoff year where Scottie Pippen was, was in the playoffs and he was real focused on, on winning a championship, his hands were on everything he could get his fingerprints on. To everything he could get his, his fingerprints on, he had his hands on assists, on rebounds, on steals, on transition, game, every area of the game he had his hands in to make plays happen. Whether you're shooting it, you're dishing it, or you're rebounding it, or you're stealing it, it doesn't matter as long as you're focused on making plays happen. Being a playmaker. You know, one of the things that makes people like LeBron or, or um, you know, uh, Derek Rose or, you know, Michael Jordan of, 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 of great years or, you know, any of the, the great ball players you, you ever come across, one of the things that makes them such great ball players is that they can make something happen out of nothing. If nothing's going on, if you can't make it, if nothing's happening, you know, it's people like Kobe who will take the ball, make a, make a move that they've perfected in practice and practiced a thousand times and score a bucket and, and put the ball in the hoop. That's about being a playmaker. Either put the ball in the hoop or stop them from putting the ball in the hoop. See, not only is it about scoring, being a playmaker is also about defense. On the defensive side, if you look at Jordan, if you look at Kobe, if you look at LeBron, all those guys are incredible defenders. They can steal the ball. They can stop the ball. They can stop the guy that's coming at them from scoring and dominate on defense. It's not just about scoring. And yes, it is about scoring too because you need to get points in the board. You need to get the points on the board to win because at the end of the game, when the final buzzer goes, nah, it's the person, it's the team who's got more points that wins the game. It's not rocket science. I mean, <laughs> that's real simple. Obviously, you need to score more than them to win the game. So being a playmaker does mean putting things on the court putting the ball on the court and being able to make a play happen. Whether it's crossing somebody over for a drive and a dunk or, or crossing someone over for a step in and a pull up J or, or knocking the three pointer down as you, know, as you step into a guy, pull back and jump up and knock the three down. That's all about making plays happen and all of that's part of the winning with the winner's mindset the more you focus on making plays happen being aggressive in your offense and your defense the more you're gonna win because it's the person who's coming at you that makes the play happen so if you're gonna you know be one of those guys one of those ball players who you know uh, runs when everybody's coming at them and, and hides behind mommy's skirt well you know, you're, you're not gonna, you're not gonna win. However, if you're gonna be one of those guys that's willing to charge in and make things happen, play after play, day after day, you're gonna make the wins happen. You know, it's no coincidence that, you know, people like Michael Jordan or, or LeBron James or Kobe Bryant, they also lead the league in, you know, times at the, 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 the free throw line because they're going in to make plays happen and drawing contact. When you draw contact, you get to the foul line and you get free points. Everybody likes free points. You just sit there, drop them down, and it's free points right there. Free points. Free points because, you know, they, they made contact. So get good at drawing contact. One of the best in the league at that is Paul Pierce. Paul Pierce is amazing, and he actually has all kinds of little tricks he does to, to fake people out, to get them up in the air so you can draw contact. You get them up in the air, you jump, draw the contact, and throw the ball up. If it goes in, great. You, you score a bucket, and you get another free point, uh, free 
throw to, to make, a, make another bucket. However, whether you do or not, you're at the line scoring points. Free. <laughs> so, being in the winner's mindset, being an athletic super achievement, comes down to being a playmaker. So go out and make some plays happen today. Make it a great one.